Hey guys, it's Inka. So I'm actually in Shanghai for a few days and I decided to make a quick trip to Hangzhou because apparently the fanciest KFC is right here called K-Pro. It is a healthier and fancier version of our neighborhood friendly KFC. So I am super excited to check it out and see what it's all about. We're gonna start here. Let's order a salad to start things off. Pasta salad? Or should I go with the mango? There's a lot. Oh, this is so hard. This one I think has crawfish. We should probably go with that. In here we have a sort of vegetables. We have dragon fruit, we have avocado, we have corn. That looks really good. Let's do a sandwich. This looks so good. Chicken in here, there's crawfish, there's mayo. We have to go with this. You can't come to KFC and not have chicken. Let's order this truffle flavored chicken wing. If you wanna do fancy, you gotta have truffle. Oh, there's so many things. The juice is all fresh. <gasps> Wait, there is freshly squeezed dragon fruit juice. And to finish it off, there is a durian crepe cake. Is that too much? This is what we have. Yay! And now we wait. All the food is here, it's been served just now. I look like I'm about to do a mukbang video. I'm really excited, this is a huge amount of food. I'm actually gonna try the freshly squeezed dragon fruit juice first. I'm a huge juice fan. Dragon fruit is really popular here in Asia. Honestly, KFC is like the last place I would expect to find it. That natural sweetness, very refreshing. This is honestly something I would expect to find at like Juice Generation or Press Juice 3. I don't even think there's added sugar in here. It's straight up just dragon fruit. It says, tasty, fresh, ready. Sounds about right. Here we have the truffle chicken wings. This is what it looks like. It looks really good, smells really good. This is actually truffle. Oh, I taste the truffle now. That bit on top really was shallots and onions, and then I think they drizzled truffle oil on it, so you get that slight taste of truffle. I actually haven't had KFC in a long time. And the chicken is tender. This is really good. Is it okay if I finish this? The next thing is the salad. It is in this huge huge platter. This is wild. Can you believe? You get all these different ingredients. There's avocado, there's corn, dragon fruit, chicken, crawfish, and then there's egg. Proper silverware at a fast food restaurant. Not something you normally see. Let's try to grab a bite that has everything. This is a huge bite, but the flavor is good. When there's so much variety in here, and the ingredients are fresh, that is something that I wasn't coming in expecting. Also, this portion size is gigantic. This is not just for one person. I love this little flag on top, the little K-Pro sign. This is what the panini looks like. You have the bread, the chicken, and then you have what I believe is Office. Apparently it's the number one recommended item here. It looks like something that you would find at a bakery. That's spicy. Oh, I didn't know it was spicy. Woo! Unexpected. You do actually see chunks of crayfish. This is legit! It's not too much bread, it's not too much meat. It smells great. And I'm gonna eat more. Hmm. Durian crepe cake. You really do get that really pungent smell of durian. And you can see the layers. That's real durian filling. For people who don't know what durian is, durian is a Southeast Asian fruit. It has a lot of thorns on the outside, but on the inside it's soft and pillowy. It's one of my favorite fruits. The only thing about it is that it has this really pungent smell that a lot of people don't like. I love crepe cakes, I love durian. Down to try it. What is whipped cream and durian puree is super creamy. To find it here at a fast food chain and to do it well, that's really, really impressive. My breath is probably gonna stink for a long time. I think that concludes my time here at K-Pro. I really love what KFC has done here. They're really trying to make their menu healthier for everyone. If you get a chance to visit Hangzhou, this is definitely one of those places you should stop by.